Cool woodshop. Some of my favorite tools is this 18 inch ruler. I love working with the solid ruler for finding my measurements. Easy to read, easy to use, much better than a tape. One problem with it is I can't put it in my back pocket or my apron. Um, it always falls out. My other tool that I really like is a nice measuring gauge or marking gauge so I could have um, repeatable marks. And I also like um, combination square for the same reason. I like setting those offsets and then repeating them on all my projects. So I was thinking about all these tools and I put together um, a sliding rule like this that does all of those and better. First off, it fits in your pocket beautifully um, or in your apron. It's a 10 inch rule, clear markings. You just loosen up these and then this travels out. So you have a 10 inch rule all the way up to 18 inch rule. But what's really nice about it as well, it could work as a marking gauge. So you could just set that at whatever, an inch and a half say, tighten it up. And then if you wanna mark a board, you could just set it there and then use it like a marking gauge. But what's really nice about it as well is that you could also use it as a ruler stop. So if you're trying to follow a thickness, you could just set this ruler right to there. And then even though you could read that it's 13 sixteenths, you could just take that over to say your table saw and set your blade height or a router bit height. If you want to keep any measurement, say the width of this box, you could do that as well with this. You could just loosen it up, bring it on there to that shorter measurement, and then use that side and use it like a ruler stop. And now you know you're at uh, five and a half. So this is a 10, and then when it extends out, this will be 11. So when I'm measuring this way, I'd be at five and a half for that width. But I could also, you know, if I'm doing inside measurements, if I want to find the inside measurement here, I could actually just take this and fit it inside the box and find my inside measurement, lock it in place, and transfer that measurement anywhere. The sliding rule.